Now underneath the front of the truck, let's go ahead and remove this shield. Now that we have the shield off, you're going to find that you have a mounting point in the center. We're going to, of course, have to remove that bolt. And then all the way down by the engine, you're going to see that you have another mounting point. Okay, so now the next thing we're going to do is move our collection bucket underneath this area right here. That way there we can remove this mounting bolt and then remove the lines from the filter housing. Give this a nice wiggle and break it free. There we are. Now let's go ahead and drain out the oil. So now I'm going to continue on with a nice long extension and a swivel 13 millimeter socket. I'm going to come all the way down along this area, along those lines, and then we'll remove the mounting bolt. Let's go ahead and grab one of those lines, give them a nice wiggle, and break them free from the engine. There it is, friends. Okay, so now that we have that out, what you're probably going to notice is I still have my gasket on the engine itself. We need to remove that. There we are. Once that's off, go ahead and wipe it down. And we're just going to use a nice razor blade and we're going to carefully remove any of the excess stuff around the area. And now, of course, we'll do the same to the filter housing. Okay, friends, now that we've got everything nice and cleaned down, it's going to be time to install our oil cooler line. Something that I like to mention, it's a good idea to use a small amount of engine oil along the gasket area here. Go ahead and make sure that it's on the line and it's ready to go. And we're going to go ahead and bring this down and put it into the engine. Be careful not to get any debris in there as we go down along the line here. Line it up with its corresponding holes and you should feel it slide right in. Let's leave it just like that and start in that mounting bolt. Let's go ahead and start in that bolt and then we'll snug it up and torque it to 26 foot pounds. Now let's go ahead and put in our mounting bolt for the center here. Let's go ahead and put on a little bit of engine oil on here. Bring it up, put it into the oil filter housing. Okay, now that we have it lined up, let's go ahead and start in this bolt. We'll snug it up and torque it to 26 foot-pounds. Now let's just go ahead and clean up our mess. Now let's go ahead and get our shield back up on here and we'll snug up all of our bolts. 